Hello there. The Emperor has been expecting you. What is up everybody? Josh here with Lorgasm and let's talk about episode 3 of Camp Cretaceous. This episode starts off with Darius uh, drawing a pack of compies that are sleeping together and then Kenji scares them off and he goes and takes a shower. Uh, they're marking the days off on the wall. I think it says it's been 22 days based on the markings on the wall they're making. Um, they're all just hanging out. They got a nice camp. Uh, Kenji runs out of water while he's showering. So Darius goes down a slide that they have built to go fill the tub that they use for water with water. And they see that the water that runs through the camp is dried up. Where did all the water go? So Kenji and Darius decide to go on the adventure to go see what's drying up the water. Kenji and I will go figure out why the river stopped. Sorry, Kenji, do what now? And Brooklyn, Sammy, and Yaz go on an adventure to find what the humming noise that Brooklyn keeps hearing is. I hear that hum again. Uh, the whole time Kenji and Darius are on the adventure, Darius is trying to get Kenji excited. But since Kenji is or was a rich boy VIP member of the island, he's he he has seen everything, so nothing is like really exciting him anymore. And then the girls on their adventure, um, Sammy and Yaz are like connecting and they keep making like inside jokes and Brooklyn feels left out. And then it turns out that they all like the same TV show. So they get excited about that. And that is when they find more frozen flowers. And it turns out that the frozen flowers grew out, grew over a vent. Now they're going to try to find what this vent connects to. It's super cold air and the grounds vibrating <gasps> Darius and Kenji find where a waterfall should be and so they do a, they rock climb up and they see that there's a tree blocking the water it's created like a natural dam and there's two stegosaurus right near there that are fighting for dominance and they get the idea to get a stegosaurus to knock down the tree with its tail Hold. No. and it works and it sends the water rushing back so they start following the water and they run in or well they run away from the stegosaurus because it keeps chasing them and they they follow the water and it leads them into a ceratosaurus which just stares at them i don't know if i said that right by the way but that's how i'm saying it it's the carnivorous looking well not looking it is it's a carnivorous dinosaur with a horn on its nose ceratosaurus that's how i'm saying it it doesn't it just stares at them uh kenji holds up a butter knife but it doesn't attack them um it turns around and walks over and it, there's a giant watering hole that a bunch of dinosaurs are at darius mentions dr grant watering hole dr grant theorized they could become neutral ground for predators and prey under the right conditions he theorized that under the right conditions watering holes could be like a uh, neutral territory that nobody attacks each other it's like a peace area it's switzerland so it just goes over next to the other dinosaurs and starts drinking and standing next to a stegosaurus uh and then kenji and darius walk down next to it and they start drinking water as well uh the girls see that the vent leads to dr Wu's genetics lab so they follow it there and they go inside and they start searching around for something but they can't find anything and then the baryonic show up
who Sammy named Chaos Grim in Limbo. She names after the little TV show that they all have, whatever, but those are some pretty dope names. I'm not gonna lie. So they're hiding from the Baryonyx within the lab, and Brooklyn finds an envelope that has E750 on it, uh, and she says she saw the same thing on Dr. Wu's computer. She takes that, and they start hiding, and then they start running, and she drops the envelope. And they get out of the building, and they run into the last Baryonyx, which was outside. The only two were in the lab. The last one's outside. They run into it, and then it hears a call from the other two on the inside. It distracts it, and they take off running. Kenji starts crying because of how beautiful it is of all the animals, like, drinking water together and having peace. Darius, thanks. This is so cool and then he tells Darius that he should write in his little notebook uh, about it since he discovered it and make Dr. Grant jealous I wish Dr. Grant were here he'd write the most amazing article about this you don't need that guy you got your nerd book no I'm just messing around if this really is something no one has ever seen I bet you could make that Dr. Dork mad jealous that you saw it and he didn't while the girls, after they ran away, they're hiding behind a tree and they're relaxing and catching their breath. Sammy pulls out the envelope because she grabbed it before they took off. And it turns out to just be full, filled with uh, these cards that have numbers and a bunch of random letters on it. And then a, like a badge. And then they make it back to camp and everyone starts celebrating because everyone did good. And then as they're celebrating, they see a campfire in the distance. What is that? We're not alone. So they're not the only humans left on the island, but who could it be? Is it Ben? Is it a rescue team? They think it's a rescue team. But is it a rescue team? Is it Ben? Is it other people that just happen to get stranded on the island? I don't know. Uh, but the episode ends there. Solid 8 out of 10 episode. Uh, more action in this one. It was good. Nobody died yet. So that sucks. I really want. I'm hoping Sammy goes out. I'm tired of her. I'm not a fan of her. Kenji, this episode, he grew on me a little bit. He was all right. Wasn't as much of a a-hole as he usually is. But yeah, so now I'm excited for the next episode. Who are they going to find? I don't know. I doubt they're going to rescue this early. Uh, there's eight episodes in the uh, in the season. This is only episode three. So I doubt it's a rescue team. It's probably Ben, to be honest. But it could be other people. They might find other people. I don't know. But we'll find out. So that's all I got for you today. Thank you for watching and I will catch you guys next time. Peace.